Good morning, everybody. I just wanted to make a quick video of our Sunray 109. It's offered up for rent on uh, Outdoorsy. Uh, you can find it on RV Share. Uh, also, our website is OK2, the number 2, camp.com. OK to camp.com. Uh, so, just wanted to throw this in there for maybe a little better visualiz visualization. Uh, so, start right here uh, it has a, a seven pin round plug uh, you can also use a four pin I've got an adapter a four pin flat which I don't have a picture of right now it has a two inch ball uh, but I have an adapter if you have the have a four pin flat it just won't charge the battery uh, has pretty good ground clearance on it uh, has outdoor speakers right there and right over there outdoor light runs off the battery step inside this is primarily a couple's trailer sleep just a couple of people it has a gaucho style bed that you can just pull just pulls right out real simple mechanism the cushions lay flat makes a uh, full-size bed uh, has a small fan in the top to move just a little bit of air if you're not actually plugged up to power and you just want to run off the battery uh, there's the thermostat also has a couple plugs uh, for charging your phone USB plugs uh, has speakers indoor has a radio right here you can hook your Bluetooth uh, to your phone or your device up to it and uh, stream from that as far as audio it's not a real high quality sounding but it'll play inside and out if you just need a little more volume has just a standard uh, air condition, a small air condition, which will run you out in here and keep you freezing cold. Um, pretty basic controls, like you expect. And uh, that's about it in here. Uh, not, this like I say, it's just a fast walk around. I'm trying not to joust too much as I get out of here. So I can say it does have pretty high ground clearance but it's not actually for going down rutted trails but you can take it off in a pasture or something if you need to and it's not going to drag bottom real easy so here at the back you got a microwave if you're hooked up to electric again that does not run off the battery uh, it's got a pretty nice little fridge this will run off the battery and propane or if you have it plugged up to uh, uh, the 110 a regular power at a campground uh, it'll run off that has a small sink uh, does have hot water uh, has a two burner stove here and it has an igniter so uh, if you don't have a striker no biggie has just a little bit of cabinet storage up there those doors just you have a little flap stays it's kind of nice uh, a little storage under the sink um, and uh, this is got some tanks and things underneath it so we'll walk around this side this is the hot water here you shouldn't have to mess with that this right here you unscrew this and we've got a bucket we'll supply you with this does not have a gray water tank when you of course there's no bathroom in here but when you uh, are draining uh, you're running your sink you can just stick a bucket down here it'll just run straight under your bucket so when you get done washing or whatever you can uh wash some dishes and the bucket starts to fill up you can just go dump it out away from your campsite so this is all labeled this is a city water connection so if you're at campground you just want to hook your water hose up to here and it just spins on threads on just like pretty basic uh, if you're going to be boondocking and so you won't have access to water before you get to your campsite You can stick your water hose in here and fill up a uh, 16 gallon. I believe it is Fresh water tank and this has an onboard water pump That will pump it out to the sink This is where your electric cord goes you just uh, It just pushes in and pushes out. There's no fancy reel. I didn't bring the key out here this morning but this is an outdoor shower 
if you're the campground you're staying out and doesn't have a shower and you're just desperate for it well it has just a, a little water connection a little handheld water shower head and uh, you could get by with that uh, just a little storage room here I don't know if this is unlocked yeah so we store a few things in there you'll need like the buckets and the water hose and a couple odds and ends that's about it I apologize this is not a high quality professional video but I just wanted if someone uh, wanted a little bit more than you could see from static photographs be able to see it thanks